welcome back to my channel. Oh, I thought that was America. Heathrow Airport, and I think that's where the marches come out. Anyway, we're on our way to our flight, we're on our way to our gate. Very exciting. New York, here we come, baby! Okay, so we're just waiting for our flight. Oh, so we're yeah. flying from London, so I think it's nine hours, is it? Eight. Eight, eight, or nine eight, hours. Like eight or nine hours. I'm gonna enjoy a lot of editing. I'm gonna watch a lot of movies. That's my favorite thing to do, you guys know. Um, and James is gonna watch movies. I wonder what movies they've got. They usually have recent. They usually have like ones that are coming in the cinema. Yeah, they, they do. do. Oh my God, yeah. but if there's a good one, I'm gonna have to watch it. Yeah, maybe start the flight off with a movie. Yeah. Um, so we made it onto the plane. We've got loads of room. We've got a, a TV, TV a remote. We've got all we need. We've <laughs> got our laptops. We've got your little pillow. I've got my little pillow. Good night. Good night. You're meant to use the pillow. You're not meant to hug the pillow. Good night. No regrets. I was teaching you how to sleep. Sleep on a plane. This is a gun room. We've got orange juices. <gasps> Look at this. We're being treated like queens. I mean, she did just ask me. Oh, really? I'm a big deal. Yes, boo. Well, she asked me if I wanted orange juice or prosecco, and I obviously panicked and went, "No thanks." And James goes, "Did you just panic and just say no?" Yeah. And then he goes, "We'll have another orange juice." What do I do without you? I know. Thank you. Bye, Mila. We miss you. I'm just watching my story of Mila over and over again. James, pra practical James, reading his safety card. None of us is going to survive. <laughs> so many freaking planes taking off. We're still waiting to take off. have our first round of drinks, Kaos is doing some editing. I might do some editing, probably won't though, probably gonna look for a movie oh. to watch. Look how nice this is, I got a proper mug. How come you got a proper mug? It's so good, isn't it? And proper glasses. No, it's a plastic, I think no. they're plastic. No, it's not. Oh, they're not? No, it's plastic. That's so good. They just make them nice and small so you don't get much. Oh my gosh, look at this, we've got afternoon tea. 16 minutes, oh, 15 minutes oh, to go. Landed in New York. We're currently not too sure what we're going to get up to. Um, we think <laughs> that we are probably going to get a taxi to the hotel because it's quite a lot of different metros and stuff. It's quite really difficult. windy. So we're going to go back inside and we're going to see how to get there. It's cold. In we get. Thank you, James. You're oh, wow. Okay, we're in the lift. Look how many freaking lift numbers there are. We're not used to this. Right, so here we are. Here's our little, oh my god, that's what? a ball. There's a yoga ball. <laughs> oh, this is cute! Oh my god! Hey? Way I think they try funny. and like really down the wellness path. You know, they've got a wellness centre, and this is our wellness room. Oh my god, is that a wine? Oh my god, it actually is. That is so cool. No, this is too funky. Oh, nice! Oh, I'm liking this. This is very nice. Hi, guys. Hi, I feel like my brand's really fitting in here. Nice choice, hey? Who picked a good hotel? Whoa! Oh my god, look how high up we are. That's so scary. We're not used to this in oh the UK. Oh my gosh. We're all on the floor. I know. Look at that building. Oh, that is a big one. Oh! Like a side of that building's come off, the one next to it. Where? Just sliding <laughs> down. <laughs> so we think we're gonna go off now and like find a little place to eat or to drink. I fancy like a pizza. Yeah! I fancy food. I fancy like picking Such. out. Cause you know, I, feel, I don't feel jet lagged, but I'm tired. So I think if we're gonna stay up me for much too. more than an hour, I yeah. need to like get just a lot of calories in me. <laughs> yeah, I don't care what calorie I do. They're gonna be unhealthy calories. Yeah, it's gotta be unhealthy. Okay, okay is this outfit like you look ridiculous, New Yorkable? Like you look ridiculous. Just because you don't like puffy coats. We've realised that this is obviously a very fitness and well-being centre. Has you know yoga and. All of these exercise things. Look, we've got a big yoga ball. Um, and Karis, you know, she's got her Lulu's on. She's fitting right in. I Lululemon fitness. leggings. And, and then trainers? a big teddy bear coat. Cute. I feel like we just want to do the small things out here. So I've never had a Dunkin' Donuts. So we've <gasps> got to go to Dunkin' Donuts at some point. Yeah. Hopefully there's one nearby. Um, yeah. It's through like seeing the Statue of Liberty. I want a Dunkin' Donuts. I want to see if the Starbucks coffee is any different. Oh my God, same. And I want like, deep pan pizzas, hot dogs off the streets, not off the streets. But you know what I mean by that. 
I'm gonna spray um, this and you're gonna choke and run can away. You do it? Like, I'm um, I'll do like, it and then we'll leave. Can you jump out the window and do it on this little balcony down here? We're pretty high up though if I jumped out. Do okay. you have any idea where my nail glue is? Um, no, I didn't pack it surprisingly. Did you? Ew. Yeah. I did. Well, it's somewhere then, isn't it? I don't know where it is. <laughs> I just care about the passports. That's my go-to. Not your nail glue. Don't oh know where God. anything is apart from the passports. <laughs> They're safe. <laughs> Solid. Okay, I'm ready to go. Okay. I'm okay, no. <laughs> okay, Seth. I'm ready. No matter what James says, I look like a brown snowman. Fly, babe. I'm ready for New York. This I is my New York green, coat. The brown and the black and the black and the Thanks. Blonde. It's actually my comfy outfit. Stop trying to cover up the fact you said Does I don't. You look comfy. Wait, but you have like big coats, don't you? What's wrong with my hair? Yeah, nothing. You look amazing. Thank you. I'm just getting back at you. Wow, so much colour. Actually, I really can't talk. This place is so fitness and healthy. They even said you can have complimentary clothes for the gym. Yes, if you forget shorts and stuff. Like shorts, socks. socks. I actually thought, whoa, I could do with some spare socks. Should we first? Huh? Should we check out the gym? Yeah, go on. Let's check out go the gym. On, it's clearly going to be a good one because this place is like fitness I health. It for the gym. It was between this and a different one. I chose this one. I don't the know gym. why. I don't know why. Because I, I know that I'm going to really want a gym. Hmm, I think we'll go to the gym. Pizza! Zero time. <laughs> Pizza! Oh, we found the gym. Okay. Ooh, gym stuff. This would actually be quite good, you know. Quite good for pics. Let's go eat pizza. <laughs> Right, so Karis has her data on her phone when I don't have any data. So Karis is having to be our navigator. Uh -oh. So we're looking for Starbucks. Okay. Starbucks. No, we want to try Starbucks because Starbucks is the big one, I feel. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, they've got Starbucks everywhere in this place. Literally. <laughs> well, let's just go to the closest one. Okay. That looks look good. Look at that. One, two, three. Okay, this oh, one. Do you want to go? They look okay. Let's go. To, let's just head for that one. That's a two-minute walk. We can we push can... ourselves. Well, let's. Should we have a look on the? It's difficult to look through the camera. What do the... you think? Um, so we spotted a McDonald's. So we think. Change the plan. We think we're gonna go and test out McDonald's because we fancy some food. Oh my god, guys! They don't have Coke Zero. Have I thought. I thought cool. New York was like the Coke Zero place. Yeah. I thought America was like I Coke Zero. America clearly hasn't got Coke Zero yet. Oh Maybe no! It's like a luminous. It's like the rest of the European fancy. You know how when you go to fancy, you have Fanta orange. We're so easily amused. I know. Okay, so we've come. Yeah, we've come to McDonald's to try the McDonald's. We are McDonald's lovers in the UK, and so we're gonna taste and see if we can taste the difference. Okay, chicken sandwich. You going for it? Go on, Boo. It was actually quite stressful. Identical. Oh, interesting. It's not seeding with chicken. It doesn't taste like chicken sandwich oh. at all. Maybe I just haven't had one in a while. I'm the one who has one every time. Yeah. The sauce isn't even mayo, is it? I don't know That's what it is. Peppered. It tastes good though. It tastes lovely. really good. It tastes better. It always tastes better. Mm -hmm. It always tastes better in foreign places. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How are the chips? Do they taste the same? I'd say so, but you're going to even taste some of the other. Oh. James, you literally just think everything. They taste exactly the same. <laughs> mm. Oh god. But how's the crispy tender stem chicken crispy? Really is it? I don't usually. Like I didn't actually see any nuggets on the menu. I'm sure there is, but. Do you like it? Mmm. Is it good? Mmm. I don't usually like these. Mm. No, it's really tasty. Mm. This looks quite posh. It's got a bun, it's got a little tomato, it's got some chicken. Don't get those in the UK. Oh gosh, no, you don't get the little tomatoes, you just get one big fat tomato. I know! Cute! So Paris, how did you enjoy your McDonald's? Oh, your first, really not your first probably. It's good though, isn't it? It was really nice. Really nice, I really enjoyed it. Um, so we're basically now walking towards Times Square. Um, just taking in the sights, taking heading for in. Times Square, just to do something. <laughs> I'm not too sure what we're heading for in particular, but we will get a coffee soon. Yes. Maybe in like 10 minutes when we get there. Yeah. <laughs> right, we made it to Times Square. I think this is Times Square. Is this Times Square? <laughs> that sounded really happy and enthusiastic. Right, we made it to Times Square. It's Times just Square. getting busier and busier and I'm just going to walk. <laughs> It's crazy. It's so cool yeah. though. The oh, you... billboards make them look I know, amazing. they're absolutely ridiculous. Everywhere. They're just another level, aren't they? Look where we are. m and World. I can't say no, I will. I've never seen m ms like that before. Obviously, because it's I Love New York. <laughs> I want to try them. Darn it. They should have samples everywhere. I know. <laughs> okay, so we've done M&M World. I did re refrain from buying anything. You know what? Um, you struggled, I know. 
I know. That's all the chocolate and all the PJs. I'm one of those annoying people that likes buying stuff in places like that, even though everything's like 300 pounds just for like one. You can just pick up a packet from um, Tesco. For like 2p. Like much cheaper. Much I know, cheaper. but it's like the experience, you know? Experience of then queuing for longer. I know. Paying more. There's no benefit. The same. <laughs> <laughs> Practical <laughs> James, he crushes all my dreams. Oh, anyway, no, I didn't stop you. No, you, you didn't. Stopped yourself. You didn't. I know. I was. I had. What would Practical James do in my head? But I will treat myself to some stuff. Yes. But I didn't feel like I found anything in there that was worth it. Did, anyway, did, we're gonna you head. Didn't find your heart. I didn't. No. Um, we're gonna head to Starbucks now. We're gonna yeah, try we're gonna the Starbucks. Yeah. See if it's see the same. Caswell, because she has like lattes and it all tastes oh, the same. Boo! I might be able to but, taste the difference between my latte. And you might be able to taste the difference between your Americano. We'll see. We have the Statue of Liberty. It's from Sesame Street, was it? The, yeah. the red one. How are you coping, Boo? You facing away? You don't like the fancy dress? He's gone. <laughs> there we go. There she is. We're trying Starbucks. 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 We're going in. Right, so we have our two Starbucks coffees. The Starbucks are chaotic. And they, they clearly don't really just sit in Starbucks yet. So we've got takeaway. It's like so quite takeaway. Is this mine? Grande Latte. It's hot, isn't it? Well, I have a sip, but I'm not sure. I just bought a white Americano and they didn't know what I wanted. Hot? Hot. Mm. Tastes exactly the same. Yeah, it's hot. Yeah? Exactly the same coffee beans, there we go. I know, it's the same guys. It's not a spitting. No, but we'll have it anyway. Right, so Karis was very sweet and she allowed me to watch some football in an Irish bar. So we had a couple of drinks. We had fun. And now we're going to look for somewhere for food. Karis has somewhere in mind. What's it called? Ellen's Stardust Diner. So you apparently you know. guys have been uh, recommending <laughs> this. Um, it's very so exciting. It's we're an experience. we're going to check it out. But apparently there may be a long queue. Yeah. So we're not too sure. Although, yeah. We thought maybe tonight would be better because it's a Thursday today. And we, we thought maybe a Thursday guys. would be better than a Friday or Saturday. And we're vlogging today, so and apparently Eight. it's fun. I don't know. Let's have Eight a look. minute walk. Let's okay. go. This way. That way. So we stopped vlogging yesterday, guys. It's now the next day. Not that you would have known that. Next we evening. Next evening, yeah. <laughs> it is, it's dark outside. <laughs> so we stopped vlogging yesterday. Okay. We were in the queue for Ellen's and the queue was just like really long. Huge. And it would have been mad waiting. And then we started like walking hours. home and our camera went dead. Yay. So um, we thought, let's leave the vlog. We came back home and charged it. And then like I went to the gym, Kaz just went to. We, went, we had quite an early night, didn't we? I think we slept we like were 11 hours last night. It was slept so, so nice, yeah. it was unbelievable. Honestly. And then we decided to day not to do any vlogging we thought we'd take a Vlog day free. just to kind of wander around take some photos and stuff so what do we get up to today so today we first went that to sounded the... like i was like a presenter i know you so what today what do we get up to today karis we go first <laughs> Don't eat the way experience. experience. <laughs> so we no professional. set off this morning the and um, we went for a bit of brekkie which we didn't um, oh, actually yeah. get on camera Oops. Um, which was very nice yeah, and then we nice. went to something called Top of the Rock and uh, went up and it was just like an amazing view, you went up in an elevator, it was nice yeah. and quiet, there was no queues, it, wasn't that it was busy. brilliant, which went was straight good. up, lovely view, got a couple of insta pics. We did, it was, was just like an amazing view of New mine, York basically. Mine was better. Just James's saying. was good. You know, I went for the full kind of effect. And yours only took three shots. It, well, it always does. Yours takes when a good get, yeah, kind of fine. 50. You can just get it right the third Minimum. time, you know? So, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, that was really good. Basically, when we were at the top of the rocks, my contact lenses started oh, yeah. paying up massively. My eyes started swelling. Yeah, they were really I really swollen. don't know why. So I had to like take my contacts out so I was kind of, couldn't see Cont anything. He was literally blind. For a long time. Um, so I took them out, <laughs> and my eyes were just watering, and like I think everyone thought they were I was red, crying, crying about something. So we had to come back to the hotel to get my glasses because I yeah. couldn't take them with me, which is so annoying. And like, Karis was never gonna me. forget that. Karis was my um, guide dog. You were so good, like it was like you could see everything. I, I, was, know, like, I wasn't that bad. What? I was like, are we meant to go this way? He's in the Eighth Avenue. And yeah, I was having to like try and figure out the way, and he was like, this isn't the way. And I was like, you can't even see. How do you know this isn't the way? But it was quite funny because I was walking past things, and I was like, oh, that's a Starbucks, just because the workers were wearing green. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. That's so weird. I don't know how you no, felt, but yeah, basically James walked home. My eyesight isn't that bad. Oh my that's gosh, that feels like bad. ages ago, but that was literally was earlier today. Back out, and we went back to Ellen Stardust. Oh Barbara, yeah. 
which we meant to do yesterday, and we queued, and we still queued for about 50 minutes. Yeah. We looked on Google and it said like, at the busiest time, it's, it's a 30, 30 minute queue, and it was 50, and it was quiet. Yeah, they were like, this is so quiet. <laughs> And we were like, right, we right. 50 minutes. We had, we had really, really good food. Good food. I had a burger and some cheese kind of <laughs> triangles to start. Well, they I was good. had mac, mac and, and cheese bites. bites. And then I panicked when ordering. Yeah. I ordered a pasta that I didn't actually want. It's just, just obscene. A, I that's just... a penne pasta at an American diner with broccoli on it. What did I do yesterday as well? I keep doing really stupid stuff here. I keep getting really flustered and ordering the wrong stuff. <laughs> have you not looked through the menu? Because Carl's just had. thing and she goes to a restaurant and like, she'll just sit there. No. And I'll be looking through the menu, like cover to cover. She'll just sit there, and then the waiter will come, and they'll go, "What would you like?" She'll go, uh, <laughs> "Um, do you have pasta? Uh, I have a pasta." I get no, stressed. I pasta. I feel like I can't read the menu in time because my dyslexia. You didn't so I just try. give up. I'm just like pizza burger. Okay, it's fine. You're like, there's a picture that of pizza one. on the front. Oh, pizza. <laughs> No, I, I did, I, I read the pastas and then I just panicked and yeah. picked pasta. Nice. But anyway, it was really good. Milkshakes, the milkshakes and coffees were really good. And, and was, a brownie. And we listened to all the singers and the singers were really amazing. So, and so, was, so, so talented. If you, obviously you guys, most of you wouldn't know, but like, it's a place that you, people queue for it for so long, not for the food, but because they've got really amazing singers there and they audition to like, um, the waiters are also the singers. Yeah. And they audition to work there. Yeah. And like, they... Like while in New York, they're auditioning to like for Broadway shows and stuff, and that's kind of all their dream to yeah. get onto Broadway. <laughs> I literally um, oh we got a metro we got our first metro oh and we, we got that was complicated yes it was really complicated. complicated we tried to get a ticket something happened we got loads of tickets and then we finally figured out how to do it <laughs> that was amazingly <laughs> and we went to <laughs> we went into the, one station basically yeah. bought tickets went through onto the platform and then realized we need to be on the other side of the station and in London once you kind yeah. of go into the station, you can get anywhere within the station. Do that. But we had to get to the other side of the platform. We had to leave the station and then go back in on another street and pay for tickets Buy again, even though we were on the right metro line. I know. And then my ticket didn't work on the way back, and then we had yeah. to rebuy it. It's like we just ended up spending a small fortune just to get to Brooklyn and back. Like, why do you have such a complex <laughs> system here, guys, in the new, in new York? <laughs> Very complicated. And it's labelled. I know. All the signs are so difficult. Like, anyway, we were place? going to um, the Trade Centre. Yes. Um, World Trade. World and, Trade Centre. Oh my gosh, Center. Patrice Flash and Red Vlog Life. And we went to the 9/11 Memorial, that and we amazing, saw the, the fountain. It was absolutely mm -hmm. incredible. We did the tour in the museum, and that was insane. I feel and like that was just kind of like you know. When you know each other so well, you end each other's sentences. <laughs> and we went to the 9 Museum. Oh, the, the fountains. Yeah, that's okay. it. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. No, you the, got the, 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 um, the unlimited pools. What are they called? Infinity pool? Infinity, Infinity pool. fountain. They, Infinity they were pool. insane. They were so, they were so, beautiful. so beautiful. And um, the museum was amazing as well. And really we did the whole good. tour and it was so special. And then we, we looked back. around the shopping centre and then we came back and yeah. now I'm really tired. We're going to go to the gym and edit videos. So we've had a good time. I was well rounded up at the end Thank after you. a slow start. We, I know. We nailed that. I'm a slow speaker. That was very good. So that's it from us, guys. Um, please do give the video a like if you enjoyed and leave us a comment on anything. Whatever anything you fancy. At all. Um, what else we're gonna say? Follow us on Instagram, and the next vlog's gonna be good. I don't know what it is, but it's another one. Something here. New York, so hopefully. Hope you enjoy, we'll and see you, uh, see you soon. Thank you for all your support. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye. Turn on the bell.